Welcome back everybody to Farming Simulator 22 here on the Western Wilds. Today we're going to see how wild we can get. Apparently I still don't have something right here folks. I just don't have something right. Uh, he or she, I don't know who's driving right now, should unload into me now. I mean, uh, I thought it was a trailer, but apparently not. And uh, here I have bells in my way. I want to see when I get to the end. See, nothing. I'm going to hop on over real quick. I'm going to de-hire. Should have seen who that was, but of course we, you know, we didn't have very much air we could put in here, but I just want to make sure that uh, he gets back to that end and pipe out on this side. So yeah. Oh, didn't know the combine up already. Okay. Um, just for a real quick reference, so you know, I don't know if y'all want to see this or not, but I gotta figure out what's wrong. Um. I don't think it's, let's see, I know it's not going to be under that, or that, or that, or that. Course play worker, there's no course play working. Um, broken threshold, let's see here. It's not that, and it should be uh, combine setting. Stop while unloading, deactivated. Uh, combine self unload. I don't know if that's it. Straw wealth activated. Unload on first headland. Combine self unload. That should be activated. Stop while unloading. No. Nope. Uh, speeds. Let's see. Let's save the game with those settings. And we'll go here and see today's first day to do the wheat. And then canola should be today but i think it's going to be tomorrow i think we'll, we'll check it out here in a second uh, as you can see july the first uh, we are we are july the first so looks like a good perfect day july the second's good august first august second then september we got rain um wheat farmers market it's up to 1474 but we are storing it because right now July is not the best price here it shows $8.90 maybe it is the best price I, I, I have no idea anyway we're gonna go ahead and hire a worker and who we got who we got okay we got Christina Cole back again oh, oh, get back here I don't want to be you don't want to be behind the combine when something goes shooting out the back all right Yes, I, I did get this uh, Lizard 12T. I don't know if it's 12 ton or, or what, but it's just a 12T. Uh, MJ on there. I love the tires on this thing. Uh, if I just love it. Uh, if it had the older look, I shouldn't be having skinnies on something like that. I should have a little bit wider tires. Oh, 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 I went. Yes, we. I went and got the auger, auger thing there. Sorry to say auger wagon, but I'm pulling the auger wagon. Now I want to go ahead. We're just going to fill this hopper up. We're not going to. Oh, sure it's filling up before I got there. But this is what I got it for, so we can unload into the it. And that's going to be our. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and shift this off. And we'll go over here, see if we can get this thing to, to finish doing what it's supposed to be doing. Uh, start the engine. Um, I really don't know. Let's see. Back on that. Uh, or is it on the tractor? Let's see. Follow. Change. Does worker speed limit nothing there? Okay, uh, switch over one. Uh, basically the same thing. 
Except for pipe in. Uh, should be that. Pipe out. Yeah, I don't know. I think there's a key bind somewhere. Uh, our sheeps are doing pretty good, but you have to. Yeah. Now look, let's see. It's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12. Alright, so we got 12 all together. That's, that's what I wish they would tell us. But anyway, they look like they're doing pretty good. Uh, donut straw. Oh, we got. We do have that straw. 26,000 liters. I guess we could do that. Lemon. No. Um. They don't say nothing about straw to the biogas plant, so I'm not even going to take it, but we did buy the biogas plant that I know of anyway. <laughs> yeah. Game settings, general settings. I still don't see nothing in here about uh, combines, so. Alright. Uh, uh, construction blade mode. Accelerate now. Uh, player vehicle. Um, sorry, folks. I'm looking. Uh, vehicle work. Uh, vehicle front loader. Crane. Vice wheel. Camera game. Vehicle gearbox. And then that's straight up in there. Vehicle lights. Radio. Field service trailer. Third person. Not used. Lance on there. Vehicle hotkey. Auto drive. Uh, bail count system. Bail texture changer. Bail bank management. Open bank management. Left shift plus M. Better contracts. Building. Da -da -da -da. Push play. Inputs. Fast night, Sandy, take fast night out. The mod ain't active and it's still showing up in here. Follow me, got it steering. And I'm just trying to see real quick, folks. Well, there's Terraform. Enable Terraform on active vehicle. Okay, well, we know to use that next time. Well, that's everything. Um, I don't know. Um, it's like it's trying to do something. Oh, maybe I get more in there, it'll do something. I have no idea, so. Now I'll be right back. I still don't understand it. Unhired a worker. Hired worker. Unhired a worker. Huh. Ah, my, my. The combine experience. Something I have no idea. I'm probably going to take that off next time I play, so. And I'll tell them, folks. Unloading again. This time I dehired the worker before I even. Oh, when I jumped in the combine, I dehired. As long as nobody's sitting in it. Yeah, I'm just going to let him. Yeah, I had this guy down here picking up bales. And this guy needs to make some more bills. Uh, yeah, it says I can hire a worker, so I don't know. But anyway, um, while that's unloading, let's go into or get up here to and pH, nitrogen, yield. Here's our yield bonus. Uh, green is good, the yellow is not as good, but this is our grass field here. And this is our wheat field that goes all the way up. So not too bad. Alright, it's empty. I'm going to go ahead and hire a worker. I'm just going to jump out. And get around before you start spitting stuff out at me. I can probably haul handle another load but I'm just going to take this back and uh, show you what I did with this uh, bagging system to get it to work. I basically just unhooked the bag and rehooked it so I don't know if it's going to start working every time now or not. I'll have to tractor her running. I don't see nothing moving. In real life, it pushes 
this bag pushes against this as it loads and the tractor goes that way and uh, but on the game the bag pushes it out this way so that's the difference in Alright, I don't think we got enough in there. I'm gonna pull up away and then I'm gonna detach the bag and reattach. You see how it raises it up so far and I'll pull up a little bit to right there and let's watch see if anything moves. Oh. Right there. I can see it emptied. I also see two areas now that we got well, where I go. We just had one, but we got 28,115 liters of wheat in here. Ooh, ooh, I'm just gonna leave it running. You know, like I said, uh, the combine usually stops somewhere wrong in here. Shut that off, save fuel. I'm still making a 200 and, uh, yeah, the 220 uh, centimeter bales. Turn that on. We are going to scoot over now. I uh, don't think we can do actually three. No. We'll miss it a little bit. We probably could if we wanted to, but it'd be alright. I also had a mod on here that would tell me when the combine was full. Um, I guess, I don't know, combine experience took it away? I really don't know. Well, like I said, I need to an an answer. I, I need to pause the game and go out and save it, but I'm just going to go ahead. We'll do that on the canola. We got more canola than anything. Is it actually full? It'd actually be full. <sighs> that sounds about right. But anyway, I'm gonna bring y'all back when we're a little bit closer. Right. Dehire worker. Uh, anybody knows what, what am I overlooking as far as getting this to unload without having to dehire the worker every time? Please let me know down in the comments. This thing's doing pretty good. We might use it to harvest the canola, but that'll be for this season. So, uh, oh, wrong side. A lot of times I have trouble getting in the vehicles too. I think I can hold one more decent dump from him, so I'm just going to move it down. Well, I guess I can go ahead. It ain't going to take that long. I know we use this grass for something or right here. I thought we will keep her use equipment, but I like to keep equipment under her shed. But a lot of times farmers don't. All right, you look real close down there by the speedometer. You can see that bag is pushing out. A little bit of time, but it, it is pushing out now. So whatever I've done, it worked. So that's good. That is good. Now we're going to get back to bailing a little bit. I'm just going to leave this guy here, shut the motor off. There's our tractor with the, how many bales we got? 66,000 liters of straw. And folks, we don't, 1,705. I, I think I'm gonna pass on that. And yeah, we'll pass on that. And, no, I'm gonna get some of the straw off the, oh, we we'll kill it. Not good. All right. Get it off this end right here. I'm 
Now I told you about, you know, we got the trees from my area right there. You can see where the trees were. And we got five thousand dollars for that in the last episode. And um the price is still good after we get this field done we might go ahead and sell it for that I, I don't know then again we might just wait to see what that price actually gets up to do this oh I don't want it that low go about 15 let's see what we can go 32 is what we can highway speed. We can bail about 15. Ooh, always leaving some. Uh, I want to. I forgot what I was doing, folks. Oh, I was going to show y'all those prices. Let me get turned around real quick. I just like doing that so I can uh, have a thing to go by. Um, wrong one. I want to go in here. And we'll go down to here. And then we'll go over to auger wagons. And then we're going to go all the way over right here. Uh, the bagger thing itself was 21000 Um the, this thing was 550 each. I think I got two of them. And the auger wag auger thing to unload them is 21,000. So, well, going out of bounds. Going out of bounds here. And nearly full grain tank, 80%. So we need to get on back. Well, that bell dropped this right in spot, didn't it? What I usually do when I'm doing this, I'll take this and bring it over to about right there. Yeah, I do have a, let's see, methane and water. Well, if we're out of rock, don't really know. How that works. Oh, don't go in the other part. Just want to make sure I got all the straw up because I'm planning on not plowing this in this time. Alright, it has a full grain tank, so we're going to stop this. Shut the baler off, shut the tractor off. We're going to go over here, start our thing up, and go unload the combine all right that was a full load oh well not a full full load but almost a full load for me uh i did uh, exit the game saved exit and come back in and yeah, looks like my door is wide open all right there you can see it real good how the bag is growing towards the back so you want to just set your tractor where you want this end to be and then of course your bag will go out the back opposite in real life anyway I got to figure out which one of these is the door Aha, there's the door window okay, all of them shut and as you can see it's like Pinocchio nose getting longer and longer now when I did come back the red thing was in the middle of the white yeah so take that in consideration all right I don't know exactly your combine should be right right here when it comes back so I'm gonna shut that off I'm gonna Run, skip, jump, hop, you name it, get down here. Start this bad boy up. Let those down. And I'm going to turn this on. 
and yeah just not quite uh, wide enough to go all the way across so I'm just set my GPS all the width for sure and lock on and as you can see I got all the bear bales up from that end so I'm just going to come off of here real slow like oh it would oh well shutting the baler off and now I am going to just pop out of the bale oh still two in there okay oh I hate it when it does that I hate it when it does that folks of course, I gotta go and reset the uh, trailer because I haven't been on it yet. So let's go do that. Uh, R and ba boom. It's on. It's on. We got three bales left. Okay. Now, I, I don't even know if the contract's still on there or not or where it would go to. Oh, I walked too fast. Can't run and do it. Okay, throw, pick up, ah, there we go, throw. But yeah, I took combine experience out, and it still won't fill. I have to uh, get in, dehire the worker, or, or make them get out of the seat anyway, or her, and uh, yeah. It'd be about, you know, about where those birds at, if you can see them on the screen there. One thing about it is that's, that's when it gets full, and then I unload them, and then when you get to down the far end, I unload them again. It's not. It'll be way back here when he unloads. Well, it's about the same, so nearly full grain tank. Um, go in here to precision farming and go back up. Uh, seed rate, yield rate, as you can see, yield's doing pretty good on that north end up there. But down here on the other end, not quite. And if, uh, this was doing like on, uh, what is it, Am Creek? first game we started playing I could just pull under here and start unloading yeah but it will not do that and I see it's making it all the way down to this end now if I get filled up go ahead and stop that right there surely it'll make it to the end yep make it to the end I'm gonna fill up well folks <coughs> I never thought I'd do this again. Uh, <laughs> been a long time since I've done this. Uh, you can probably look at the time. Which ain't too bad. It's July the 2nd. What, 102 in the morning? We're down to $151. And I ain't done. Why? Well, this will probably be about a been about two or three hours now. Oh, oh, it, it is gonna, yeah, it's going. It's been about three hours in real life, in my life. Uh, I received a phone call and said that, you know, their burn pile is getting out of hand. The city burn pile, that is. And <laughs> I'm like, okay. Well, I, I'm heading that way. By the time I get to uh, call the sheriff's office, tell them to page out, you know, everybody else so they can help. And uh, I, I just grabbed my stuff from here and left. I grabbed two bottles of water and, and slapped my pants on real quick. Cause I always set my shorts, at, not my underwear, but my shorts, you know, PJs. And uh, play the game, record, and stuff like that. You know, it's cooler. So I just slapped my pants on real quick, grabbed my radio, 
my necessities, water, you know, went out the door and went to fight it and stuff and ended up paging out another fire department for a tanker because it's probably about, I don't know, about 20 acres plot where the city takes their trash, not their household trash now, this is like limbs, uh, leaves, stuff like that. They uh, take out there and like refrigerators and stuff like that and they'll take out there and every once in a while they'll set stuff on fire just to condense the, you know, the area. So we are like, you know, we leave the fire station, we see the smoke, and oh my goodness, it is, the wind's blowing about 20, 25 mile an hour. So yeah, it was a good time. I'm tired, wore out, just like the rest of the guys. And uh, yeah, so that's, that's what happened. Uh, <laughs> When you leave in a hurry and you leave your game on. Uh, I hit pause on the recording, but I forgot to to uh, pause the game. So here I am, one o'clock next morning, harvesting in the dark again. And I want to apologize for. The last episode, because oh man, I'm leaving a spot again. The uh, last episode, I started out with it being dark, and uh, here I am ending this in when it's dark. Well, hey, y'all get to see some nighttime harvesting. Gotta get over this a little kitchen outside, because we're the pickup is just a little past that wheel there. That's why I gotta get. It won't take three all the way down. I can that down. I'm gonna just this over this way to about there. <sighs> oh, and it left. So back up, get over this a little bit. I don't like leaving it any of the straw. Um, you know, we need every bit we can right now. I don't know if I'm going to sell it or I'm going to save it. Um, I want to get started on cows. Uh, don't tell me the combine's full already. Yep, it's heading back this way and it's... Oh, what did I hit? Oh, I made a bale. Okay. I uh, ain't full yet, but he's fixing to be. Alright. Go this road. I'm just going to stop this right here. Pick that up and go ahead and shut everything off. At least that's still like it's supposed to be. Turn that on so it'll be warming up. Nearly full green tank. But yeah, I'm bring y'all, it's uh, 32 minutes right now. I don't know what I can get this edited down to. So what I'm gonna do is uh, come back here at the last bit so y'all can see it. So you can see how much wheat we got total. And uh, be a couple minutes for me but it'll be a second for y'all so I'll be right back all right <clears throat> I'm back we got I think it's the 34 there's 24 there 25 26 27 28 29 30 31 32 33 34 we got 34 bales there and we are done this uh we're over here, it's completely done. We got about three quarters of the belt in a baler. Combine's empty. I just want to take a, a screenshot real quick. Flight mode on, hood off. And y'all want to find out how I do it? This, this is how I do it. I just, 
I come in like this and uh, try to find the best. Like I want to get more of that in there. I'll just come over and do this. About right there, probably. And I don't never take one. I like taking two or three. That's going to be kind of wide there, so I'm going to come back over here again. Yeah, about like that, maybe. Okay. Now, let's see. Let's go in here and turn all this back on so we can see what we've done. And I'm going to shut these off. Whoa! Ow, that was sharp. Let's see. Turn the motor off. That is quiet. It's hard to hear. We're just going to leave everything where it's at till morning. Should take the combine in, but we're going to, I'd rather blow it off out here in the field. Get all the dust and everything off of it. Uh, I got to do some settings to get over to, to canola. But this is what we got left in the buggy. 1,490 liters. And then we're going to go up here and see what we got left. I might sell some of this wheat and then I might turn around and keep some of it uh, for our uh, I, I want to get some chickens oh we'll get, get in this spot alright okay this buggy's empty so I'm going to fold in the auger it does fold in, or back, I should say. Shift this baby off. Then we gotta get this thing working. Uh, going in the store. That's not the store. Going in the store here. We're gonna go down one over to auger wagons, and we're gonna go buku crazy to the other end. Uh, to about right here. I'm curious to see how much this holds right here. Um, 200,000 liters. So 200k liters. That's good. Because um, we only have 69,196. But, uh, yeah. It's, it's, oh, tractor was running. Start it back up. Get back on that again. I'm going to detach. I'm going to pull up. Wait, it show. I still got some in the hopper. Well, let's see if that's... Right, only thing I got and it's going down so I guess this thing's actually working now I guess you can't oh I got oh no nope. all right now I'm hooked up Still showing I got some in my hopper there. Alright, so being unhooked from it actually works better than being hooked to it. Well, that's all the wheat there, so I don't have to worry about being hooked to it. Let's see what it... We got any way of seeing one. Well, it looks like something's on the ground there. Uh oh. That's not good. What was that saying? 69196. Okay, let's go into. Uh, do we have a silo? We don't have no silos or anything, do we? And uh, I know of. Uh, oh, it'd be this thing right here. Yeah, right here. So it's not showing wheat there anywhere, so. 
But anyway, uh, wheat prices, you know, we're, we're July the 2nd, and wheat is down pretty low. Um, showing eight eight ninety for the high in December. But if we go back to the prices, you can see how some of those prices are low. But farmer's market is set at 1474 so we'll probably be selling it there, but... I don't know, we gotta figure out a way of, uh, way of doing everything, so, but anyway, uh, folks, it's been going on long enough, it's been got dark on us, my mistake for in real life, um, we're gonna try to load it in this, and use it, just use the machinery we got to, to work out and stuff, but we'll, I think I'm leasing this, I need to, let me go in here real quick and finish showing y'all. Um, where is stuff we use? Use vehicle sale. Man, look at that header over there. 41 foot. 98,000 for the uh, Furler X Flow 71 Grain Auger. That's the only thing that's got in it. It's four right now. A 20 meter auto load. Ooh, that's cheap. Let's take a look at this. Oh my. We need a big tractor to pull that baby. 400 horsepower big. 71,000 liters for it holds? Or is that 710,000? I don't know. Hey, I don't know. I'm not good with that. Oh, wait. I was supposed to go. Own items. Uh, auger bag. Auger wagons. Uh, we got two of these. Let me sell them back. I didn't know we could do that. Uh, this is stuff that we bought right out. Uh, lease is right here. Auger wagons, this. This is the part we lease, so we want it to go back. Select. Oh, I leased that too. We'll probably be leasing this for a little bit longer because we're going to be using it on canola. You know, I hate have to. Hmm. Anyway, I'm going to lease it so we don't pay no more until we get ready for uh, canola, which might be tomorrow, so I hate to have to release it. i tell you what, it's already tomorrow. I'm gonna shut this thing off. I can get in. Nope, can't get in. There we go. Shut this off, we'll look. Let me just go ahead, I'm gonna fast forward time through the night so y'all can see the, well, there won't be no night prices. We done past midnight. Crapola. Alright, um, let's go to about six. We're out of water and methane too. That's gonna hurt. Seventy-two dollars in the hole, ninety-six wedge payment. Whew. Let's see if our canola is ready to harvest now. Go to here. Um grass on go to there. Harvested. Ready to harvest. Okay, our cotton and canola. We have more canola than that. It's going to be ready before the cotton is, so when is canola supposed to be ready? Canola. Oh, yeah, see, canola is supposed to be ready now, so it might be. Oh, okay. It was July 2nd. It's still the same day. I thought it was another day, but August the 1st, that canola should be ready, so. <sighs> I'm gonna go ahead and I, I'm returning it, folks. I, I'm just gonna. I see. I guess I'll go in here and return it. Did I return? Oh no, oh, I got two. Okay. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna return both of them. That way we don't have no more stuff. We can unload this with that one machine into hopefully that trailer. We're gonna try that first. We got some silage bales to sell in the next episode. We'll probably be taking them to our BGA plant. I don't know if we actually get money for them, but uh, yeah, we'll, we'll try to do something. But anyway, folks, I appreciate each and every one of y'all. I love each and every one of y'all and our strawberries and stuff. We already got two pallets of tomatoes, two pallets of strawberries, like five pallets of honey so we can have a few things to sell 
so we can afford to lease something. Let's check our bees. Uh, bees are down to 701 out of a thousand, so. And we have some, uh, what are these? Cucumbers. 700 liters of cucumbers. Cool. It's coming on long, folks. I will see y'all in the next episode. Uh, I gotta quit rambling, so I love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Y'all have a great day. A blessed day. Here's our solar bells. And I will see y'all later. Thank you.